Monday, students and staff of Phelps, welcome back from your weekend. I hope it was fantastic. If you did not know, yesterday started the Chinese New Year, and it is the year of the rabbit. Always trying to teach you new things here on our Monday morning broadcast. At this time, would you please stand as we welcome Romeo and Nora, who are going to lead us in today's Pledge of Allegiance. to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Welcome back, everybody. It is Monday, January 23rd. On the menu today, it is meatball grinder with cheese, tater tots, baked beans, and a fresh cup of fruit. Now, this week, we are going to learn how to say a fresh cup of fruit in Chinese. So to do that, we say, Yibei, Xinxie, Shui Gua. Yibei, Xinxie Shui Gua. Yibei Xinxie Shui Gua. That is how to say a fresh cup of fruit in Chinese. Just a reminder, the school store is open this week. You have those cool coupons. Ten cool coupons each. You have your choice of those spiky little critters, the water bottle stickers, and the mystery box. That is a brand new thing. I have, honestly, I have no idea what Mrs. Domina has in store. I just want to be excited. Come share with me this week what you got in your mystery box from our school store. This week, we have a brief presentation on Tuesday morning for our second and third graders. I'm going to find my, I got lots of papers here today. Uh, for our second and third graders on internet safety. So we have some representatives from our community coming to talk to you about how to use the internet safely um, and respectfully. Other news and announcements. You have a half day this Friday. Teachers are going to stay once again. We have professional development, but students, you get to go home early. 12.20 is your dismissal time on Friday. That's all for our Monday morning announcements right now. Let's celebrate this week's birthdays. And we love celebrating your birthdays. You know that. I'm excited to share this amazing day with you. So, in our second grade, happy birthday this week to Maxim and Allie. And over in our third grade, happy birthday, Will. Over in fourth grade, happy birthday to Meta. In our kindergarten, happy birthday, Kareem and Miriam. And in first grade, happy birthday, Emerson. And let's celebrate those half birthdays. So this week we are celebrating the half birthdays of third grader, Oscar, in second grade, Romeo, who just led us in our Pledge of Allegiance. In the first grade, happy half birthday to Brooklyn, Liam, Matthew T, and Max R. And in our kindergarten, Happy half birthday, Nev. And in our fourth grade, happy half birthday to Schlock. I hope your day is amazing. Make it special. Happy birthday. Hello, students of Phelps, students and families. I am so proud to be a heart partner school with the American Heart Association. For I'm also excited for us all to take a challenge for our hearts and for our health. Last year, Phelps participated in this challenge. Mr. V teamed up with Mr. Kimball. We raised money for the American Heart Association and we did a lot of self-care for ourselves and for others. 
So I have accepted the challenge once again as the principal of this school, and I chose for us to both think about being active and being kind to others as part of our challenge. Now we had the option, but I want you to pick the one that means the most to you. If you want to focus on being more active in your lifestyle, moving more, that is a great way to take care of our own hearts. If you want to work on being kind, being kind, not only does that help your heart, but that is something that you can do to help the hearts of others. So like I said, I've signed up and I have accepted this challenge as your principal, and now it is your turn. When you join our Kids Heart Challenge team, you're gonna pick your challenge too. Are you going to be active? Are you going to be kind? I'm gonna do my best to be both. But if you wanna think of which one is important to you, that's all that matters. So once we do this, again, this is a fundraising option too, not a requirement for everybody to participate, and certainly not a requirement for all families to donate. But we are looking for some donations to the American Heart Association. You can do that right when you register to participate in this challenge. Once half of our students in this school sign up and choose your challenge in the Kids Heart Challenge webpage or the app, and we reach a goal of $500 in life-saving donations to help the mission of the American Heart Association, our school will earn an extra $500 to shop for physical education equipment from US Games. How does that sound? Now, last year, only 30% of Phelps participated in the American Heart Challenge. I know that we can get up to 50% of this school. That's not that many more. I can't wait to see how many of you sign up to be a heart hero this year. Let's do it. I'm going to be sending home some information with Mr. Kimball so that you can join this challenge today. Namaste, Kaylin and Ella. Thank you so much. You had me all the way up until the splits at the end. That's where Mr. V draws the line. I need to be able to come to work without an injury. That is all for our Monday morning broadcast today. This is Mr. V saying goodbye for now. And remember that kindness counts, so do small things with great love. Have a safe, responsible, and respectful week, and I'll see you around Phelps. Wah, 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 wah,